What's up, guys? John here, Titan Talk Tuesday. It's good to be here. Another week, another day. Loving it. Blessed by God to be here. So thank you. Appreciate all you guys tuning in to Titan Talk Tuesday this week, especially. This is going to be a good, good show today. Um, and it just worked out. Most of the topics kind of just go with each other. And I think you guys are going to really like the topics. What's up, Elmatic? How you guys doing out there? Restructuring Utah, Modern Day Advisor, Hovino, how you doing? All right. We even got Lana on there. How you doing, Lana? And Barbos of Films. All right, so this week we're doing the blood work special. So in blood work, we obviously are going to check a number of different things for males and females. And in this episode, we're going to talk about hormones, different happiness hormones, um, why it's essential to check hormones and your blood work, how sugar affects the body and what it does there, and even some crazy things going on at Burger King. So that was just my throw off topic that I had to throw in at the end. But let's talk about the blood work special. So if you guys don't know what we do in the blood work, we do a little bit different tests for males and females. But for the males, we do like a comprehensive metabolic panel, which is going to cover like liver, your kidneys, electrolytes. We're also going to do a complete blood cell count, covering white blood cell count, red blood cell count, hemoglobin, hematocrit, a couple other things in there. Also going to do PSA. So for guys out there, it's prostate. Also lipid panel, full cholesterol, triglycerides, right? HDL, good cholesterol, LDL, bad cholesterol. And then we're going to dive a little bit deeper. We're going to go into free and total testosterone levels. We're going to go into progesterone levels, estradiol levels. We're going to go on IGF-1 levels, which are growth hormone levels, and B12. So for guys, the discount for you guys with the special this week only is $130. Bucks. It's usually $200, and usually if you get a discount, it might be $150. So you're still going to save money doing this. You could be a new patient, an old patient, somebody want to just come on, check their blood work. We service nationwide, guys. So all you have to do to sign up for the blood work or to get the blood work special is call or text 727-389-3220. Um, females, we're going to do all those tests that I just named. Plus, we're going to look at a couple extra hormones for you guys. Uh, total estrogens for females, DHEA. We want to check a little bit more into it. It's a little bit it's a little bit more trickier, I think, to dial in females. I mean, I, I think any HRT provider would tell you that. So, guys, a special for females, 200 bucks instead of 300 even if you were to get the special, it would be two twenty-five dollars usually. So you're still saving $25. Bucks. Nobody has this pricing, apples to apples, lab testing, anywhere in the country. So it's the most inexpensive blood testing you guys can get. Now, I always get the common question, John, well, I could probably get some blood work done by my primary care doctor. Well, the thing about it is, is we don't take insurance. And most insurance companies restrict doctors on kind of what they can run and what they do for you guys. And, uh, you know, it's, 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 it sucks really, but these doctors don't really want to open the door to some of these tests or don't know about some of these different tests because they're not informed or not educated on some of these different things. So at that point they're like, well, why are we going to run these tests? You know, wh what's going on? And they don't give you the time to really explain what is really going on to dive deep into the problem that might be going on. Um, also when they do write these tests, if they do, then the insurance company wants them to produce a diagnosis code to go along with what the diagnosis is be of the reason why they would run these blood tests on you. And some just won't do it. Or if they do run the tests on you, the insurance company might kick back that bill to you guys. And it might be a thousand plus dollars or more. Just depends on the testing. So for us, it's the most inexpensive way that you guys can check your levels. If you guys want help, we can service you with all our therapies. The medical provider can go over the blood work with you guys, go over your goals, help you out with a regiment, personalized treatment therapies that we can re recommend from Titan Medical Center to you guys. And they can get shipped directly from the pharmacy straight to your doorstep anywhere in the country. So it's real simple and easy. You guys can do telemedicine if you guys don't live in Florida. I get that question a lot. What if I'm out of state? Can I take advantage of the blood work and all the other therapies? The answer is yes. So all you guys have to do is, is use your smartphone and you guys can literally fill out the new patient paperwork online. You guys can do your medical, uh, your, your televisit online uh, with your phone, your tablet, your desktop, 
whatever you guys want to do it's real simple and real easy and the blood test if you guys just want just your results from the blood test you guys can get the results if you want if you don't want to become a patient after that that's totally up to you but at least you got some ammo to maybe go back to another primary care doctor or whatever you want to do at that point you know what's going on so you guys can be educated with your health i think that's a big thing out there a lot of people aren't educated about what's going on on the inside of their body they always look on the outside of their body because that's really easy to do they can't really run diagnostics like a car unless you run blood work and it's really hard for some of these doctors and some of these medical providers out there to want to listen to the people what's really going on and to truly help them get to feeling well or optimal wellness because that's really what it's about usually through life we're just we're, we're degrading we're degrading we're degrading and that's what happens we're young we get old and we die so at that point in in the middle of that where is the maintenance where's the preventative medicine for us um, to really keep ourselves going as long as possible and as best as possible right I, mean, I think that's the, the big thing and i always go back to an example of a car if you have this really nice mercedes-benz or a car whatever it is and you take care of the car it's going to last a lot longer and run a lot better if you run that car into the ground and don't get any maintenance no oil changes nothing happening the car is going to break down on you guys and you guys don't want to be stuck on the side of the road right so that's really where your body comes into play. Just, just kind of think of it like that, because that's what it is. We have the best machine ever created right here, right where you're living in it. So I mean, at that point, utilize it, take care of it. I think that's the biggest thing. Um, other than that, I mean, if you want to check other things, like if you have food allergies or you think you have food allergies or you get bloating from foods and you really don't know why, you can actually blood test for that too as well. You can see what foods you might be sensitive to or that might be causing you these issues, digestive issues, bloating issues. You know, people just don't feel good after you eat some certain things. We can help you out with that too as well. Along with STD testing and all the other good things that come along with blood work. We can test amino acids through blood work, glutathione levels through blood work, all these different things to help you guys really dial in what you need to and if you don't know exactly what you need that's all right that's why we're here at Titan Medical Center to help you guys our medical providers are here to direct you guys navigate you guys through the therapies the process and to get you guys ultimately feeling your best right so thank you guys for all tuning in so the blood work special going on this week it's very popular even if you're or if you are a current patient um, and you're on hormone replacement therapy with us you can get this in advance so there's no time limit, time limit on using this. You can get the blood work and pay for the special now and get the discount. And you can use it either if you're a current patient at your six month visit, or if you want to use it down the road, if you want to go in two months and get blood work, you can get the discount now and be ready to rock and roll. So Lee McGeever, I've never felt better since joining Titan Medical Center. Thank you, Lee. And Lee, thank you. You've been with us for a while. I appreciate it. I appreciate the support. I'm glad we can help you guys feel your best, especially you, man. Uh, I take great pride in, you know, in knowing our patients, so does Sharice, um, dealing with our patients and helping our patients, you know, and hearing their success stories or changing their quality of life. I mean, that's, that's really the big thing, you know, that we're all, we're all here on this earth. We're all here on this planet. We're all going through these different things that are going on outside. Um, and we just want to feel our best waking up every day, I think, and getting through our day um, optimally and not feeling down, not feeling depressed not having no energy. I mean, that's just not the way to, to feel every day. So you want to feel your best, contact us, and we'll definitely help you out. Blood work special, take advantage of it. Servicing nationwide. So we will help you guys out with any of these blood tests that you need. If you guys want to call or text, 727-389-3220. Our medical staff and our girls here and staff will take care of you and make sure that you guys or on the road to success for you guys living an optimal healthy life all right so the next thing let's get into the first topic and like i said most of these topics all go together and it was really cool that uh it just it happened like that because i didn't really plan on it to be like that but you know just certain things that i was reading right now was really cool and i think it touched on some of the different things that we do and how we can help people out and people make aware of, of really what's going on hormone wise in the body because there's a lot of different hormones right so let's talk about it so the next one is how to boost happiness, hormones, and everyday life. So when we think about hormones, there's really four major ones um, that correlate or um, that you really need for happiness or mood regulation and stuff like that. So let's talk about the four hormones that they are. The first one is dopamine. So you might hear of dopamine a lot. Now, dopamine is usually 
correlated with uh, setting or achieving goals, okay? And when we achieve goals, we, we get dopamine. And at that point, that gives us a sense of happiness, right? It's, it's, it hits the brain um, that we've hit this goal and we've got the happiness. Now, dopamine comes from different things too as well. Now, this is more of the healthy way to get dopamine. Um, for you to set goals, to achieve those goals, to move up, um, to feel like you've accomplished something. You, have you ever felt like that when, when you've set the goal uh, and, and you've accomplished it and you feel good about yourself? Like, man, like I did a whole bunch today or like I did the whole backyard by myself or whatever it is. You feel good. Now that's dopamine and that's naturally stimulating your dopamine. So you feel good, right? Now, Low dopamine levels can cause depression, you know, and at that point you could be having some issues. Now, dopamine can be uh, increased by unhealthy habits too as well. So drugs, you obviously hear of drugs increasing or hitting the dopamine, okay? So that's a bad one. Caffeine, so caffeine can increase dopamine levels. Um, so there's some different things that can increase these dopamine levels. Um, so... With this, another big one that we'll talk about, and it co correlates with the next topic that I go into, is sugar. Sugar is a huge one with stimulating dopamine levels. Um, so at that point, you don't wanna um, keep taking in, per se, sugar, and we're gonna get into that next topic. But it, having dopamine over and over and over from these unhealthy habits is a bad thing, okay? So try to increase dopamine in good ways, like I said setting goals, achieving goals, and feeling good about yourself, okay? So the next one, serotonin. So serotonin is a neurotransmitter, um, and it plays a big role in mood. Uh, it helps with reducing depression, regulating anxiety, and a number of different things. Confidence actually triggers serotonin. So being confident about yourself actually will increase your serotonin, which will increase your mood and should increase and regulate your happiness. You know, and with this, I'll give you an example that I read in the article. The article was, was monkeys try to one-up each other, and so do people, and that can increase serotonin levels, um, which is kind of crazy, right? So you're trying to one-up each other and you get increase your serotonin levels. But the main thing is confidence and self-confidence. And how, having self-confidence can increase serotonin levels. Now, if you have decreased self-confidence, this is gonna cause low serotonin levels, which can cause the negative effect of looking at yourself and then causing depression and all these other things, anxiety, um, not feeling good about yourself. So the person that's always got their head down and moping and like not really confident in like talking, like they should have some self-confidence in themselves. If they have this self-confidence, they will start feeling better about themselves, uh, which will increase serotonin levels. So this is a good thing to increase in the body, especially in a natural way. The next one, oxytocin. So oxytocin is really cool too because we have this in some of our different therapies. We have this in our Cupid's candy. We have it by our, by itself, you know, like nasal, by injectable. Um, and what this is, this is like the love hormone, okay? And you really increase oxytocin levels naturally by kissing, hugging, right? Sex activity, that's another one. You can supplement oxytocin in by a therapy. That's another one. Um, you know, physical intimate contact uh, with, you know, either a person or even your animal. Think about when you hug your dog, right? And you love your dog or you love your cat or whatever it may, may be. You know, at that point, those oxytocin levels do increase. Now, with oxytocin, it's used to help people bond. So when they're bonding, you know, oxytocin is increased even more. And it actually lowers down inhibition a little bit and lets you feel more comfortable and trusting with somebody. So you may talk about things you might not talk about with somebody uh, else, right? You trust this person, oxytocin levels increase, and that might lower inhibition and you don't be able to open up. Oxytocin has been used with this with couples, especially um, that have problems and cannot communicate. And at this point, it opens up the line of communication and actually helps the relationship. Now, it can help with sexual pleasure too as well, okay? With females, especially multiple orgasms, um, they give it to females for birth. Uh, at that point, it helps them with the birth process. And another thing it does is it actually helps with the bonding with the mother and the child. And actually, when the mother holds a child for the first time, levels of oxytocin raised to a great high level, which is really, really cool. To the baby 
and for the mother. And that's where they, the, the ultimate, the bond comes in. So really cool, really, really cool oxytocin. All right, the next one, endorphins. Endorphins are awesome. Now, usually endorphins go right along with exercise, right? And let's talk about the example that I'm going to give you guys. The runner. The runner has the runner's high because when running so long and the high kicks in, those are endorphins. And endorphins are really, really cool. And, uh, you know, I've known about endorphins before, but I really read into them today. And endorphins are really cool because endorphins are incited, honestly, when you get injured or when you injure yourself. So endorphins help you when you're injured not feel the pain. So when a runner hurts himself or a basketball player or a football player, hurts themselves, not to the fact where they can't walk or run, but where they might be hurt, maybe a sprained ankle, whatever it is, and they get through the play or get through the marathon or whatever it is, and then afterwards, oh, man, this is really messed up. But at the point, they really couldn't feel it. You know, one, because adrenaline might be kicking in, but the other one is endorphins. So with endorphins, they're really, really cool. And like I said, you can get them from pain, but you get them from ultimately exercising and stuff like that. Now, People that are over-exercising to get these endorphins is not a good way. It's not a good thing to self-mutilate yourself or hurt yourself to get endorphins either. All right? Use, uh, you know, physical activity to get these endorphins, uh, and you will get and feel really, really good and happiness. So it's, it's really cool. Um, another way to increase endorphins is laughter, naturally. Eating dark chocolate is another one. Um, watching your favorite drama on Netflix and working out and meditating like we talked about before and meditating is real. So I, you know, I've talked to Sharice about it cause you know, she's stressed and stuff like that. And she really thinks about, you know, how can I de-stress? And I always tell her, I'm like, you gotta be able to meditate and meditating has helped me quite a bit. And by meditating, I'm not talking about, it, I sit there and no, but if I need to bring my heart rate down, uh, blood pressure, I need to just reset. I can literally close my eyes, picture myself at the beach, sitting in the sand, with my feet in the sand, and hearing the water, the, the waves crash, and, and, and literally just block out everything. Really cool, man. It definitely helps. So at that point, if you guys can find some place where you guys can send yourself off to with your mind, definitely check it out. It's good for everything as far as health-wise, okay? And there's, there's some good information on it, too. So if you guys check it out. So we just talked about... The four hormones to increase your happiness naturally. All right, I wanted to, I wanted to like share this stuff with you guys. If you guys didn't know, because a lot of people, you know, they might look at themselves and not have confidence, and this could lower their serotonin levels, which could hurt them ultimately in their health. So at that point, get some confidence, right? Set some goals, have some exercise, and hug either your fur baby or your loved one, okay? And you will increase all four of those different hormones we just talked about very easily, right? All right, so the next one, how sugar affects the brain. Now, it was really cool because those four hormones we just talked about, and one of those hormones is dopamine. So sugar affects the brain in a negative light. Not all the time, though. Sugar is not bad. Actually, our body uses sugar as fuel. But the whole thing is, is taking in excessive amounts of sugar and really causing the problems that may go along with that. Now, if you have the right amount of sugar, your body is obviously going to run optimally, okay? If it doesn't have it, if you take out all the sugar, it's not good either. It could cause brain fog. You might be sleepy. You know, these are some negative effects from not having enough sugar in the diet. So you might think like, I should have sugar? Yes, you need a little bit of sugar. It's all about balance. It's not about excessiveness uh, and one thing and taking away all the rest. So you got to think about that. And everything we're talking about here, whether it's your diet, whether it's your exercise program, um, you know, these different things that we're talking about here. And this is diet. I mean, this pretty much goes along with diet. And with sugar, okay, um, you know, basically, it, it's a reward system, too. So when we eat sugar, when it, sugar hits our tongue, it starts stimulating dopamine. And dopamine goes along with reward. So at that point, we get programmed. And if you eat enough sugar, if you eat sugar, it's going to increase your want and need for sugar. And you're going to have more sugar cravings. And you're going to eat more sugar, which is going to be worse in your body. It's going to create... Uh, a problem for, A, your pancreas, because it's going to have to create more insulin to combat the sugar. And if it cannot create enough, that excess sugar 
spills over into the bloodstream and that is a problem because sugar is no good for cells. It deteriorates cells, it's no good, right? So at that point, and this can cause a lot of different problems, um, you know, diabetics and stuff like that. There's a lot of different issues that go along with this. So the best way to get out of this cravings, of the sugar cravings, because sugar cravings are real. You know, people think, oh, sugar is addictive, right? And think about it. If you haven't ate sugar for a long time, and the experiment they say in here is seven days, and I've definitely done this where I haven't ate sugar or very, very small amounts of sugar. And I love ice cream. I love shakes, uh, chocolate pastries. I think I just had one before the show. Like, I'll eat some donuts. So, But I, I know now because before I would just not eat any of it. And when I incorporate some of it, I start eating a little bit here. Then I, I really would want more. And I'm like, man, I'm like, I, I recognize that, man, I'm, I'm almost addicted to sugar again. And that's just no good because sugar is just, it's no good in a lot of different ways. Um, so you want to make sure that you're getting a little bit of sugar, but you want to make sure that you're keeping your sugar levels as low as possible. Now to go along with blood testing, the next thing we should talk about is hemoglobin A1C, glucose levels. So glucose levels are your sugar levels in your bloodstream. And a hemoglobin A1C is an average of the three months of those sugar levels in your blood. So really, everybody should be getting a hemoglobin A1C at least once a year, maybe twice, just to check how their average of their sugar levels are in their blood. Now, most of the time, you'll get a glucose level, and a glucose level is a fasting sugar level. So if you fast on the day that you get the test, right? You should be good and it should give an accurate number on your glucose level of that day. If you don't fast, that glucose level could be off. It could be a skewed result. With the hemoglobin A1C, you get a three-month average no matter if you fast or not. So you're going to get an accurate range no matter what happens that day or the day previous. You're going to have a three-month average and you're going to know exactly where you fall at. And this can ha help you in a lot of different ways as far as knowing if you are pre-diabetic. Maybe you do need to change your diet and nutritional plan, okay? Maybe there's something going on. And this will be a telltale for you guys just to check that out. And it's a real simple test, and any primary care should run that test for you. If not, we can run it for 25 bucks, okay, anywhere nationwide, so you guys can at least know where your sugar levels are at. These are just some common tests that really doctors should run on everybody. But they don't, okay? And that's why Titan Medical Center is here. All right, so that was really cool how those all, both those, those topics went together. Now, the last one. Since we're Halloween, I had to incorporate something with Halloween, especially this, it's this Saturday, right? This Saturday. We're going to be dressed up. Titan's going to be dressed up. It's going to be awesome. So we'll get into that here in a second. But the next one is Ronald McDonald in the Burger King bathrooms. You're saying, what is this all about? Ronald McDonald in the Burger King bathrooms. I know when I read the, 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 the title, I was like, man, what is this about? So... This isn't happening here in the United States either, but it's happening in Sweden over in Europe where in Burger King, they're actually testing this voice software, voice recognition software. And if you go into the bathroom and you say canceled clown three times, the lights dim to a low and you will see the Ronald McDonald clown in the mirror and spooky sounds come out. Who knows? This is kind of creepy and kind of scary, all right? But this happens over there, and this is a part of their program that they're running as far as a promotion. And I guess over there, they do not, like Burger King, really, they try to clown McDonald's. I know Burger King takes some shots at McDonald's here or there, but they really they really go after them, I guess, in Europe. So they do all kinds of promotions just to, like, just to down Burger King, which is kind of funny. Uh, it's just these fast food places. Down with fast food altogether, guys. No good, no good. Maybe once in a... Great while a treat, but man, you guys don't want to be eating that every day. All right, hands down, Titan Out works. Any other clinic out there when it comes to content and professionalism? Thank you, I appreciate that, NGZ. Yeah, we try to help out as much education as possible for our patients. We want to talk with our patients. We want to make sure they're taken care of. Patient health and satisfaction is our number one priority at Titan Medical Center, and it always will be. No way or how we're going to change that. Um, and possibly, any update on my blood work? Julian, text a line, 727-389-3220. Ask them about your blood work, and they'll be able to tell you exactly what's going on with it. If it's ready, um, it should be ready. If, if it, you know, whenever you had it, and it takes only like, it takes about two to four business days tops, um, and you should have the results, okay? Um, but 
We might be having another provider come on, who knows, and more education for you guys. So we're just growing more and more and more. Um, we want the education to keep going up for you guys and the patients. We're going to keep creating the greatest content we possibly can for you guys. Um, so if you guys have any questions, you guys need anything, please let us know, all right? I, 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 Z, gotcha, I, Z, gotcha, M, I, Z, gotcha. Okay, sorry about that. You know, I, I'm not, not particular on these Instagram names sometimes. I'm not good about them. Cool in the game. What's up, man? All right, so this weekend, Halloween is here, right? Also, Titan Medical is sponsoring two events on the same day this Saturday. The first one, Titan Medical Center presents the Mid Florida Classic by Deke Warner. Big shout out to Deke Warner, uh, my man. We're going to see him very shortly in a day or so. Uh, so that will be going on in the day, the day show. The night show starts at 5 p.m. Tight Medical Center will be there. We'll have the booth. Everybody will set up. We will be there in person. Um, we'll be there for a couple hours, making sure we get to check in, say hi to everybody, say what's up. And then we are off back to Tampa. Uh, we have the Vampire's Ball at the Cuban Club. Big shout out to Pied Piper Productions for putting that on. Um, it's like four-story building, four stories of things going on. So it should be a really good time. $5,000 costume contest. You know, maybe Titan might win it. Who knows? We've got a lot of cool costumes that are going to be with us It's as far as Titan goes alone. So I'm really excited about it. We're going to get back to that. So Halloween this Saturday. So with that, Halloween, and if you guys are going to do anything either with your kids or by yourselves as adults, we can go to a Halloween party or some function. We are having a Halloween costume contest here at Titan Medical Center. That contest is super easy to enter and super easy to possibly win. What will you guys win? A free medical consultation with our provider and a free vitamin amino acid injectable therapy. So that's like, I don't know, at least $350 value at least. Um, so you guys will get both for free. It's easy to enter. This is what you guys got to do. Get out your favorite or best Halloween costume. Take a picture. Upload it to either Facebook or Instagram. And I want you guys to tag on Facebook, Tight Medical Center. Or on Instagram, Tight Medical. And you guys will tag that. We'll be able to see it on the page. We're going to look at all the great entries. And then we're going to pick the winner next week, next Tuesday, on Titan Talk with me here at 6 p.m. So at that point, we'll pick a male and a female. You guys, so you guys, if you have two outfits, you guys can enter twice. It really doesn't matter. All right. Tag the pages, Facebook, Tight Medical Center, or Instagram, Tight Medical. That will I'll get you guys. So you guys are entered, and then we'll announce the winner next week here, Tuesday, 6 p.m. on Titan Talk Tuesday. Uh, 11 14. So November 14th, we've got Cars and Core Tour. Which is going to be a 1920 Great Gatsby's theme. I love that. That's awesome. Very classy. Mansion party. Fashion show. Exotic cars. The Titan crew. What else could you ask for? Okay. All right. Next one. January. And we probably will have some events in here uh, in December and stuff like that. But locked in solid. January. We have the 10th here in St. Petersburg with Festivals of Speed. That'll probably be at Vinoy Park. We'll get you guys all the information or sign up for the newsletter, guys, and you guys will get all this information with all the events. And you guys can check it out every week. The next one, the 24th of January, will be down in Orlando again at the Ritz Carlton for Festivals of Speed again. And that one's really cool. They set up on the lawn. It's just, it's awesome to be able to check out, you know, Orlando too, as well. And people come. What up, Victor? How you doing? Double check and see if the bubble came in. All right. So, yeah, just double check, and if you want to just car tax Julian, they'll be able to take care of you. All right. Weekly poll. Have you ever had a blood test to see how healthy you are on the inside? Okay. And we talked about this today because the blood work special is going on. So, if you guys need blood work or want to get blood work and see some of these different things, not just regular liver and kidneys, but you guys really want to check out free and total testosterone levels, progesterone levels, estradiol levels, growth hormone levels, B12 levels, and all that was good levels, you guys need to sign up for our blood test, all right? So 70% said yes, which is really cool. 
A lot of people are checking this. People are very, very in tune to their health now, especially with this COVID crisis that we've been going through for how many months now? And we're still not out of the woods. I mean, they're saying it's going to get worse now because it's cold outside and all this great stuff. So, guys, boost your immune system. Make sure everything is functioning optimally and inside. 20% said no, and 10% said no, why should I? So, no at 20%. Why? I got to ask, you know, why? It's just not good. And then, no, why should I? Well, you should for a number of different reasons. One, to check your vital organs. Make sure everything's intact there. Your cholesterol is good. Make sure everything is good there because you can change some different things. And if that's not changed, it can correlate with cardiovascular disease and a number of different health issues there too as well. Um, with hormones, making sure things are optimal. Making sure that you are feeling the best you possibly can, getting the best results you possibly can, and performing every day at your very best. Whether it's at your job or for your family or for the gym, we can help you guys get back to the best you possibly could feel. All right. All right. I used to drink two bottles of Mountain Dew a day. Yeah, man. Marcotti, I, I, I definitely understand that. Uh, you know, that's one thing that, you know, a lot of people cut right away. And one that's going to help with weight loss tremendously. Um, and then when you get off that kick of the caffeine through there or the garbage, you really will feel better. I promise you. Um, so at that point, a lot of people do, they take in sodas or diet sodas. Even diet sodas are really bad. And I was going to talk about one of, uh, there's another published study on um, sugar substitutes with cardiovascular disease and heart attacks. So at that point, we'll probably bring it up next week. I like to always bring those into, you know, into light so people can check them out because everybody usually, especially in the health world or fitness world, uses those uh, artificial sweeteners and they think it's okay. Um, but it's really not. I'm just being honest with you guys. So... At that point, we'll talk about it. So thank you guys. It's been a great Titan Talk Tuesday. I will see you guys next Tuesday, 6 p.m. on Titan Talk with me. Friday, we'll be uh, down in Orlando, me and Drew, for Titan Lifestyle with Big Drew. And then Sunday, don't forget, the Titan Medical Center Health and Lifestyle Show on ABC, on cable TV. Whether it's Fios or it's Bright House or whatever they're called now, Spectrum. Um, we have our show on there. If you guys aren't in Florida, you guys can check it out on YouTube or our Tight Medical Center Facebook page. Thanks, guys. I'll see you guys next Tuesday, 6 p.m. You guys take care. Love you guys. Thank you very much. Uh, guys from Texas. All right, so Jason, you're from Texas? Uh, what up, Drew? If you're from Texas, no problem. We can help you out via telemedicine or blood work. Just call or text 727-389-3220. We can send you in for blood work closest to you in your lab and your zip code um, do telemedicine so you can do a facetime with our medical provider and the pharmacies ship directly to your house um, anywhere in the united states so i appreciate it i can't wait wait till you see what me and big drew got coming for you guys i'll see you guys soon later guys